Welcome to the online video that pairs with the technique department in each month's issue. I'm Talmadge McLaurin, publisher of Florist Review. It's January, and if you're not thinking about Valentine's Day, you should be. And we've got an idea that will take you past the dozen roses, which is still king of Valentine's Day. It's a special that almost anyone who is arranging flowers in your flower shop will be able to accomplish well. So here we go. First I found this 9-inch vase, it's from Oasis, and I went to the craft store and there are pre-cut felt pieces. This one's red, but they're all different colors, and this one has an embossed pattern on it that I was particularly fond of. So I'm going to take this and very simply spray a little adhesive onto the back of it. Give it a moment to get tacky. and simply wrap it around the base. Next I want to put a row of buttons right where the felt meets and I'm going to use a U-glue dash instead of hot glue. It's a little safer. At least you don't burn your fingers. And just peel that off and apply it where the felt meets. There you go. Now for the arrangement. I told you at the beginning this is something that any designer in your shop will be able to accomplish and that customers will love. Instead of roses, let's give your customers an option. I'm just going to take as many Gerbers as they're willing to buy. Give the stems a bit of a trim. Set them right down into the base. This special is easy and fast to produce. Even your most experienced designer can accomplish this well. And it can all be done ahead of time, except for simply placing the Gerbers into the vase. If there's a little extra time and you want to make it even more special, I cut out a heart shape from the same felt that I wrapped around the vase, and I'm going to tie it on with a little piece of jute string, just to make it earthy and fun and uniquely yours. If you need a little help with everyday design in your flower shop, let me suggest this book. It's called Flower Arranging Step-by-Step -Step Instructions for Everyday Design. It has in it most anything that anyone would need to learn how to do in your flower shop. You can buy a copy today by clicking onto our bookstore right here on this website. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next month.